The reason it's called Hush House is because the test cell is actually a noise suppression system. So all the walls in here are dampened with noise dampening material. Every time the sound passes through, it bounces off the walls until by the time it gets to the other side, it's so low you can't hear it. Tesla is basically the last line of quality assurance between an engine that might fail out on the flight line and cause damage to the jet or risk mission or pilot's life and a perfectly running engine. It's test cell's job to be able to run the engine through every single possible existing parameter to make sure it's working exactly as it's supposed to. So the process to get it up and running, we'll hang it up and there's a bunch of wires and harnesses and gauges we hook up to it. There's something called a bell mouth that goes in front of the engine and it comes down and it acts as a filter and kind of an inlet for the air. And we'll bring that down and there's a starter on it. And that starter is what turns the PTO pad on the engine, which turns the core, which gets the engine going. And then after we hit max motoring speed, we can go for an ignition and that'll cause a spark and it'll mix with the fuel and that's what's going to cause your heat your gas to heat up and expand which is going to cause your rotor to spin on its own and after a certain amount of time your engine is going to be self-sustaining so you can cut out on that starter and your engine's running on its own. If the B1 didn't have us there'd most likely be a higher percentage of engine incidents or fails or mechanical failures. We catch a lot of things in test cell that allow us to stop those incidents before they actually occur out on the line or on the jet or in air. My favorite part, everyone's gonna say running the engine, that's the favorite part, especially if you know it's an engine that came in with a ton of problems and you bring it down here and it doesn't, it doesn't work the first time or the second time and you keep working on keep working on until eventually it starts up and it fires off and you get that nice flame in the back, that, that's the best feeling ever, man.